guys, last year, you might be thinking, what is that boring green bag right in front of you? Well, the bag itself might be boring, but what's inside is surely not going to be boring at all. I have another Q bag to open. I love Q boxes and Q bags because they always send really kawaii and also useful stuff at the same time. So without further ado, let's open this bag up and see what's inside. Oh, I just realized they have a tear here. Uh -huh. <laughs> Never knew. Let's see. Oh my gosh, do you guys see? <gasps> oh, 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 oh my goodness, I can already tell this is going to be good. Okay, let's see if there's a little postcard. Oh my gosh, guys, I took I took a peek inside and it looks really good. So let's dump everything out. Dun, 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 dun. As you can see, the theme is Totoro. I already see so many good stuff, so we're going to grab one item at a time and just because I touched this I'm going to show you this one first I have something that appears to be a pen and here there is a very simple cute illustration of Totoro and let's open the cap and see what kind of pen this is come on open oh oh so I think it's like simple ballpoint pen quite fine point too that's pretty nice oh, so cute so here's the first item. The second item I got is pocket mirror and I am not even going to try to read that because yeah, I'm pretty sure that's not English. Unless it's Spanish. No, I'm pretty sure that's not. Is this Spanish? No, I'm pretty sure that's like French or something. Let's open this up and give you guys a closer look on this mirror. So here's the illustration and I'm going to try not to show my face because I don't look so pretty today. The back side is a simple mirror. The illustration is nice and simple and it's like perfect size to actually have it in your palm. Quite nice, I think. I'm actually going to put this back in the packaging because I don't want to get my fingerprint all over the mirror part. I don't want that. Okay, and what is this? Oh my gosh! I thought maybe it might be like a little bag or something, but upon touching it, I just realized it's not. <gasps> Guys, look! Oh my gosh, it's a little wash, um, washing sponge or something. So when you're taking a shower, it will be like extra cute. You'll be like washing, washing with Totoro. Oh my gosh, that's so cute! There's an adorable illustration on the label as well. The back part, the sponge has two colors, which is like this beigey color and also pink color. And this is super squishy and really soft. And all the details are embroidered on, as you can see. Very, very cute. And there are some threads coming off, but still, I think he is very cute. And then this little thing, oh my goodness, is so cute. I think it's a little coin pouch. And I love that it's in the shape of a cube. I think that is really unique and cute. Totoro's face on the front is also really nice too. There's a little leaf detailing right there. I also like that they use two different fabrics, so it kind of looks like he's sitting on a grass plane or something like that. Inside there are some sponges to keep its shape, but it's empty. And there's a ball chain on the top. I think this is really cute. I think it's like the perfect size to kind of like hang it on your backpack or your purse. And right here, I actually have no clue what this is. I wonder if this is like a thumb drive, but there's definitely a USB plug right here. And there is a little charm of Totoro on the bottom. And this... <laughs> actually feels like a spoon or something the end um so i will have to figure this out but if you guys know what this is please do let me know in the comment section below i do have a feeling that this is a very useful item though then over here i got a pencil pouch so from the front it looks like little totoro and i also really love the fabric they use it's super fuzzy and the little line detailing on his belly are kind of painted on the eyes are sewed on as you can see let's open it up so the inside is lined with this simple gray fabric. It's actually quite large. Hmm. It actually looks like you're going to be able to fit a lot of stuff in here. It's actually really, really big. Very nice. And there is a little loop so that you can hook it onto something. Do you guys see little Totoro's inside? Guess what this is? It's actually... Doo -doo -doo, a set of teaspoons and I think these are so cute every morning Jenny and I have a little coffee time so this is going to be perfect for our coffee time I think each Totoro is a little different this one is smiling and this one is just like kind of like grumpy <laughs> I love them they're so adorable I keep saying adorable I should probably have like adorable count on this video too <laughs> 
then it looks like I have a little booklet here. The illustration is very simple and I find it very unique because Totoro has cell shading and it's very clear that he's out from like the animation or something. But then the background is very watercolory. And let's see what this is. Oh, it's a lined notebook, mini notebook. This is really cute. So the paper has this like vanilla color to it. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but it's got a like slight yellow tint to it. This is very useful too. And guess what this one is? It's a little letter set. So if you actually look at the top, you can tell that these are envelopes. Unfortunately, they do not come with like letter paper, but only comes with envelopes inside. It looks like it comes with quite a bit of envelopes. So this is definitely useful if you are a very letter writing kind of person. And dun -dun -dun -dun, here is the final item, which is super huge, guys. Look, it's a tote bag. I don't even think I can fit it into the screen. The bottom just has my neighbor Totoro logo on the bottom and then on the top is a very simple shading illustration of Totoro with the soot monster. And look at this. He's holding a mushroom. I just love the huge smile on him. I'm not going to take this out of the bag because yeah. And the back you can see that there is no illustration. It's very simple. It's a tote bag as you can see. This is super duper nice and the size of it is so big. Here, to give you guys an idea of how big this tote bag is, let me measure it for you. <laughs> so it's about 17 inches across, which is about 43 centimeters. And then from top to bottom, it's about 43 centimeters top to bottom, which also means it's about 17 inches, yeah, from top to bottom. So this is a very big bag. Here are all of the items I got from my Totoro Q bag. I love every single one of them. I, I feel like I say this in every single one of the Q bags or Q boxes opening but really though, they are super useful and so cute. My favorite, if I had to choose one. Oh my gosh. No, I can't choose one. Can I choose two? Yeah, let's just pick two. No, three. Three. <laughs> my favorites are this little washing sponge because I think it's really unique. It's something that I have never received from Qbox before. And then I also really like these teaspoons. And also I really love this little square cube coin pouch of Totoro. I think those items are just absolutely adorable. Out of the ones I got, which one's your favorite? Please let me know in the comment section below. And also many of you guys always ask me where I get my Q bags and Q boxes from. The information will be in the description box below. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, 